JT for Flying North Blog, reporting from the Vernadsky Ukrainian Research Station on the Antarctic Peninsula. Vernadsky Station is located at Marina Point on Galindez Island in the Argentine Islands on the Antarctic Peninsula. It was originally founded in 1947 by the British as an Antarctic expeditionary base and was bought by the Ukraine in 1996 for the price of only one British pound, since the cost to dismantle the base would have been too great. The pound coin Vernadsky was purchased with still resides in the site's most interesting location and a place where you can get some pretty strong vodka, the Vernadsky Station Lounge, the southernmost bar in the world. My name is Andrew, I'll be your guide here in your station today. The station complex consists of few buildings standing on the rock foundation. We have supply ship only one time during the year when we are changing. The last one was almost 11 months ago. One month in the beginning of April we go home. This fuel tank for diesel generator. It contains approximately 200 tons of diesel fuel. For one year we need about 140 tons. We form a fuel tank. One is now adapted for storing of building material. This is our diesel generator house or roof. We have three diesel generators with capacity about 100 kilowatt each. We are working for my two. Every diesel generator working for two weeks, but that's one and next one that's all. And while one in operation, we can maintain it and repair it another two. One of the longest operating bases in Antarctica, Vernadsky Station has conducted scientific research on long-term temperature trends that indicate global warming. No